What's up everybody? Thank you for stopping by my channel. Today we're going to be going over another puff vinyl. I'm excited. It's from America Flex. Uh, it's called Deco Puff. So let's get right into it right after this intro. <laughs> Alright guys, let's go ahead and jump right into this. Uh, this is the box that came in. Let me go ahead and open it. Got a nice little cool keychain that they give you. That's cool. Um, we got puff. Um, the best puff, most colors, fastest time. And they even gave us uh, some black puff right here to try, to try out, which is cool. Because I only ordered the blue. So we got some blue here. Already I'm liking it because it will fit in my machine and I won't have to cut it down, which is great. I believe this is 12 inches. That's what I got, yeah. 12 inches. Anything else? Um, thanks for your order. A little thank you card, which is cool. And that is it. So let's go ahead and put this in and get it cut out. All right, so one quick thing I wanted to point out when loading this into the cutter, it is super uneven when you go to load it in. Look at how much is not there for me to load in. So I'm not sure how they're cutting this and sending it, but whatever, however they're doing it, they're not cutting it even. So I'm gonna end up wasting a little bit of material. Not a big deal, but something to think about when you're making your purchase. Alright everybody, we've already laid the regular vinyl down here. The blue is going to be the puff. Um, this original design is supposed to be with pink and then white puff for the hustlers, but we're going to go with blue. Uh, they want us to press it at um, 305 degrees. Looks like we're pretty much there. We're about there. So we can go ahead and get started. So if we're gonna do it at um, 305 degrees, um, I'm just gonna do my regular pressure that I normally do with the heat transfer vinyl and see how it comes out. Everybody knows I don't like adjusting the pressure knob because I have a manual one. So we'll see if that works with the regular pressure that I use for the heat transfer vinyl. They want us to press it for 8 to 10 seconds. We're going to go with 10 and it's a hot peel. Here we go. Looks good, hot peel. Ooh, it looks good. I think we found another one. It looks really good. Let me get in close so you can see the puff. Look at that. Look at that. It came out really good, really good. So this is definitely a winner as far as the puff goes. Really good. That's gonna do it for this video. Go ahead and like it if you liked it. Go ahead and subscribe. Here at About Time, we like moving with time and time. And we hope you do the same. <laughs>